Hello, my beloved viewers, and today we are going to do um, something I am going to call the Hot Wheels Death Track 200. It's pretty simple of what to do. So the the driver the driver will launch from here and then jump across this ramp into this other ramp, slide down this track, and then go over another ramp that launches to this track, and then they will slide over into this floor. And uh, so basically, um, the bottom half will get eliminated, and the rest will um go on. Without further ado, let's get back. Let's get into this, starting with this case of cars. Looks like I got the first order to on Cripper. He's a, he's pretty good. Um, Can I help you? And he's good, but um, he's pretty smooth. But do you think that spindle back there is gonna give him luck? I don't know. Let's see. Three, two, one, launch. Bad crash. And after he got launched, um, either it was either me, or the track, or him. He tried to um, get onto the thing, but he was too off. And then he hit this side pillar right here and then flopped off the track and then landed right here. So he's gonna be next right here. And uh, I don't know, we'll see about the rest. If, if they keep bailing, we'll have to up. We got the one they call the funky one's son. You'll know who the funky one is eventually. So it looks like the strength of the um, booster is the problem. So um, I'll change that and then move him. To Next up, we got Luke Skywalker. That was depressing. Um, apparently, um, I don't know what to do right now, guys. Uh, the, uh, third booster is too powerful, and the second booster is too weak. Put him right here. I think I know what to do. La Next up, we got this police. That was one of our mo- That was our first- successful um run and um actually landed it even though he didn't land on his wheels i mean i'll still count it so he's gonna go here in front of the rest of the pack next up we got the speedy tax that did not look good um sadly that was uh, one of our worst runs along with Luke Skywalker, so he's going to get back there. Only a miracle can save him. Next up, we got the low but not so slow king. Play. Uh, the taxi looks like that he has a better chance, but the low but not so slow king turned out to be a sl a low and slow king. Next up, we got the black Dodge Charger. What an amazing go. Our first ever one to land on all four wheels and get past that ramp right there. He didn't, he didn't make it to the gray area, but that's good enough. Can he be beat? Chicane and the neon purple uh, dragon. I'm speechless, flat on speechless. 
I don't know if that hit the gray area, but now he's the second car to do those two things I talked about the last time. However, is it enough to win? So one I call the Rexter. This is stupid. This thing keeps surprising me. And you know a rule about the gray area? When a car gets in there, it's it, it stops there. And cars are, cars are allowed to smash into it. So he has a lead right now, but he might get smashed and lose it. Fast has him. An amazing time by what's his name? Uh, by Fast Time. By Fast Time. I am speechless. I'm just not gonna say anything. And case OJ. Mad Manga. Pretty nice. Not as good as the others, but still pretty good. H41 driver. Crash for the M41. He looks like uh, he looks like he's okay, but uh, doesn't look that good. BB8. Another bad crash, uh, this time by BB-8. However, um, I believe that um, oh, uh, this is the second uh, crash. However, BB-8 made it farther. So that's something. The old man. Looks like the old man um, was too jockey. The boost was too much for that butt back there. And it launched him upward, and then he started bouncing around, wasn't able to get past the... the nine Camaro. I kind of like it when they flip upside down like that. However, it's less... Ex although, it's less exciting... Uh, in distance, so hmm, yeah. The Nitro Door Slammer. Ooh. That was a pretty nice uh, run from the Door Slammer, don't you think, Dad? Yeah, you know, that was really good. That uh, run all the way around, made both jumps uh, in both complete fashion. Well done. Yeah, I 100% agree with that. He takes the lead, but can't hold on to it. The Rogue Hog. Too bad his tire popped off the track, um, and he lost so much momentum before he made it to the jump. How far, do you, Dan? How far do you think he would have went if um, his tire hadn't popped off? A uh, heavy body racer like that, and without mechanical failure, he could have gone all the way past the door slammer. 
Uh, I think he could have probably at least made it off the track, maybe in the trash can. <laughs> okay. Two more cars and then we're closing out. First, the Tesla Model S. Tesla Model S landed right next to the Rogue Hog, but it's not good enough to keep him ahead. This car, the Governor's. What a finale. I actually had to line up the cars up to see if he took the lead, and he did, by a hair. So it looks like the people getting eliminated are these people right here are going home, but they had a good time. Till next round. See ya.